Hi, this is Roger DeRue. My website is freecomputerconsultant.com. In this short video, I wanted to show you some of the differences between the available monitors that you might find for sale and in comparison to the old style CRT monitor that you see over on the far right. Now that old style monitor is actually a 19 inch, but if you measure it corner to corner, you'll find it doesn't measure 19 inches. They actually measured kind of behind the plastic on those older CRTs to get the total uh, size and it really doesn't compare as well to the new flat panels. Now this is a 17 inch standard aspect ratio flat panel and it does measure 17 inches corner to corner. This is a 19 inch widescreen monitor and it measures about 18 and 3 quarters somewhere in that neighborhood pretty close to 19 on a corner to corner basis. It has an aspect ratio of 16 wide to 10 up and down. Now the standard aspect ratio is typically 4 to 3 maybe 5 to 4 and the widescreen is typically somewhere around 16 to 10. And what that means for you is in the actual display resolution, you can get, say, 1280 pixels wide by 1024 on a standard, kind of a medium quality flat panel in the, in the standard aspect ratio. But in a standard, uh, or I should say a medium range widescreen monitor with 16 to 10, you'll get about 1440 by 900 pixels as on this particular monitor. Now you might notice that even though this is a 19 inch and this is a 17 inch, you can actually get more pixels of display up and down with the standard aspect ratio than you can the widescreen. Let's take a look at that with the tape measure. This measures right at 10 and 3 quarter inches high and this is a 17 inch monitor. It measures almost exactly the same as this 19 inch CRT. But this 19 inch widescreen is only going to measure 10 inches high. So you really do see less on the actual uh, up and down display. Now when you're viewing web pages or a PDF or maybe a, a document, that's pretty important. Now the widescreen might come in handy if you have a spreadsheet with a lot of columns or if you're watching a DVD. But if you're buying a monitor for the workplace, Unless you have an employer who lets you watch DVDs at the workplace, and I don't know of any. If you do, let me know. I might want to apply for a job there. But you really need to see more of your display typically in a standard aspect ratio. Unfortunately, standard aspect ratio is getting harder and harder to buy now as I record this November 2008. Everyone's trying to get you into a widescreen monitor. Now I actually have two widescreen monitors on my desk and I love them, but they're 24 inch monitors. So they actually will do a, a display resolution high enough that I can get all of that height on the screen that I need. But when you see a 19 inch monitor in widescreen, it may not be big enough for you. So when you're looking to buy a new monitor, a 19 inch widescreen might be fine for you, especially at home. But in the office, you might want to look for a standard aspect ratio, and that could be hard to find. If so, just go the size larger, or maybe a little bit larger yet, but it is going to cost more money. But make sure you get a monitor that works for you. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Please visit my website at www.freecomputerconsultant.com and you can even sign up for my free newsletter. Thank you.